Hello students, today we will be learning about types of angles. We will be learning about types of angles with the help of an activity. For this activity, the material which, will be, which we will be requiring are two ice cream sticks, three different colored papers and favicol. So let's start our activity. First, take the color paper, fold it little bit and press it nicely. We will be making a paper fan with the help of these three color papers. Again, flip and press, flip and press. Keep pressing it so as to make a good paper fan. Just flip and keep pressing like this. So see, we have folded it and we got it like this. Now fold this into equal half and press it nicely after doing this we will paste these two ends so let's take the favicol and paste this press it and keep it inside for dry for drying we will do the same thing with the other pa color paper fold it press it and then flip it keep pressing flip and keep pressing so as to get a nice crease like this See. Now again fold it into equal half, press it and then paste these two ends with the help of favicol. Press it and keep it, keep this inside for drying. For drying. Now I am taking the third color paper, same procedure, fold it little bit, then flip, again fold, press and flip. Keep pressing and flipping. So here we have got paper flag again press it and paste these two ends with the help of paper paste it press it so see we have got these three different fans now we will join this flan, fans with the help of favicol. So we will join it like this. So let's join it. Put favicol. I'm taking the orange one. I'm putting on it on the top of this green one. Press it. No, again. Put the favicol on the top of this green, oh sorry, orange color paper. Put the other one on the top. Press it nicely and see. Now keep this on site for, for drying. After this, take the two ice cream sticks 
now children what you need to do is you need to paste it when you are pasting it paste it in the inside in the inside of the paper flag so let's paste it apply the fabricol and insert it in the inside of this flag and paste it same we will do with this side just apply the fabricol and insert it in this other end of this paper flag and press it so see you will you will get your paper flag like this now keep this on side for some time before starting the activity let's keep it at side let it dry for some time i have already made the other one like this so this is a nice paper fan children these two are the arms of the paper fan these two are the arms so when two arms meet at a point like this these two arms are meeting at a point and angle is formed when horizontal arm and vertical arm meet at a point the angle formed is called as right angle it is in the shape of l see it is in the shape of l so when the horizontal arm and the vertical arm meet at a point the angle formed is called as right angle less than right angle is acute angle more than right angle is obtuse angle if i close if i close this paper fan so when two arms overlap the angle formed is called as zero angle and if i open this fat flag completely see this arm is coming straight so this is called as straight angle so children again when horizontal and vertical arms meet at a point the angle formed is called as right angle less than right angle is acute angle more than right angle is obtuse angle when two arms overlap the angle formed is called as zero angle and when two arms goes in opposite direction the angle formed is called as straight angle so children we have studied about types of angles i hope you all have enjoyed this activity thank you take care an angle made by two overlapping arms is called as zero angle an angle made by arms going in opposite direction is called as straight angle more than 90 degree is obtuse angle less than 90 degree is acute angle when a horizontal arm and a vertical arm meet at a point the angle formed is called as right angle